probably furnishing your house the wrong way, but that's okay. Most people do. Let me show you how you can do it differently. We're all used to going to the big chain stores and just paying way too much for furniture that's not even well made. Refinishing furniture is a great way to create your dream home. The best bit is it saves you money and also helps save the environment. You need to start off by cleaning the piece and then sanding back any areas that you want to. I sanded a whole lot of areas back to raw exposed timber and then gave the whole piece a scuff sand. I cleaned again, grabbed out my paint, stirred it up and then painted it on. This paint didn't need a primer, but because I was painting a dark color, I needed to do three coats of paint. Then I decided I wanted to change the color of the timber slightly and I applied a driftwood stain and glaze to the whole piece to give it a bit of a gray tone. I then needed to add a top coat to protect the timber. I did three coats of this and then applied some new hardware. And now I've got a solid timber tall boy that's a standout statement piece that only cost me $70. So what do you think? Is it better than if I had paid $400 for a piece made of chipboard?